Have you ever noticed that propellers are twisted from their root to the hub? This is for a very important reason. Propellers are rotating airfoils and are subject to all the aerodynamic principles of airfoils. They create thrust, can stall, and are subject to drag just like a wing is. Unlike a wing, however, the airfoil rotates. This spinning motion means that the propeller tip travels a much further distance than the hub in the same amount of time, which means it has a higher linear velocity. According to the lift equation, if a velocity velocity increases, then the force generated by the propeller would also increase. This means that the greatest thrust would be produced at the propeller tips, leading to major stresses on the prop itself. To prevent this, manufacturers decrease blade angle from the hub to the tip, reducing the angle of attack that the blade makes with the relative wind. This reduces the forces generated and balances out the thrust, creating a uniform force from the hub to the tip. A blade that isn't twisted would have portions near the hub experiencing a negative angle of attack while the propeller tip itself would be stalled. Do you know the first aircraft that incorporated propeller twist on it?